Adventures of Ozzie and Harriet, starring the entire Nelson family, Ozzie, Harriet, David, and Ricky. Here is Ozzie, who plays the part of Ozzie Nelson. And of course, his lovely wife, Harriet, as Harriet Nelson. The older of the Nelson boys, David, appears as David Nelson. And his younger brother, Ricky, played by Ricky Nelson. In the first place, who ever heard of a guy inviting his girl and her parents over to his house for dinner? Well, they just moved into town. I thought it was kind of nice of me. Of course it was. Well, okay, I'll phone the guys and tell them that the poker party is off. When? <laughs> I, I don't know. Why? Well, you can go shopping while Rick's doing his homework. I want cranberries and olives and five pounds of sweet potatoes. Oh, uh, uh, Ricky wants some ice cream. Uh, chocolate, I like. Uh, <laughs> Here you are. That'll be three dollars and twenty-five cents. Oh, uh, uh, would you mind cashing this check for me, please? Certainly. Ozzy Nelson. Is this your home address, Mr. Nelson? Uh, yes. Thank you. Oh, excuse me. Did he call you Mr. Nelson? Yes, that's right. Well, this is a coincidence. I'm Dick Johnson. Your son's coming over to my house for dinner tonight. Oh, well, he is? Yes, I uh, hope he likes steak. Well, yes, uh, that's his favorite food, but I I'm afraid there must be some mistake. Uh, we were expecting you over, over to our house for dinner. No, no, I'm sure my daughter said your son was coming over to our house. Here's your change. Oh, well, thank you very much. Well, gee, uh, how about that? We thought you were coming over to our house, and here we're supposed to have dinner at your house. Oh, well, this is a bit embarrassing. You see, we were expecting your son, not you and your wife. As a matter of fact, I'm going out bowling tonight. Oh. Uh, but we'd love to have you come over some other time. No, th that's all right. In fact, this works out perfectly. See, I, I was supposed to play poker tonight, and I was going to cancel a game when I found out you were coming to dinner at our house. Oh, well, I hope you didn't. No, no, no. I, I was hoping we'd be able to get out of... I, I, I mean, that, that's, <laughs> this whole thing works out just perfectly. Well, we'll make it some other time. Yes, it's awfully nice to have met you, Mr. Johnson. Thank you. Nice to have met you. Are you sure... I, I'm positive. Rick's supposed to have dinner over there. Well, I don't know how I could have gotten so confused. Well, he probably just, uh, well, I mean, the girl, uh, well, uh, her, her, her father was... Do you suppose being confused is hereditary? <laughs> of course not. What's hereditary? Well, uh, your confusion. Uh, that, uh, how could you get so confused? What do you mean, Pop? <laughs> well, uh, you're supposed to go over to Connie's house for dinner tonight. I am? Well, yeah, I, I, I met Connie's father in the drugstore and he told me. Are you sure it was her father? Well, yeah. See, I was cashing a check, and he happened to uh, overhear that the guy mentioned my name, and he introduced himself, and he told me you were coming over to his house for dinner. Well, gee, I talked to Connie, and she said that uh, I, she thought... Maybe her... it is hereditary. <laughs> Whatever it is, you, you better get your clothes changed and get over there, Rick. Are you and Mom coming? Uh, no, uh, we weren't invited, just you. Gee, I can't understand it. What do I do with this turkey? Oh, well, I, I can uh, serve it to the guys uh, after the poker game. Is that game still on? Well, uh, uh, yeah, it was never off. Well, I thought you called everybody. No, I, I, I didn't have time. <laughs> Don't look at me that way. I didn't engineer this thing. I hope you're as lucky in the poker game. <laughs> How about you? Uh, are you going to the movies with Clara? Well, I guess I'll have to, otherwise Joe won't be able to come over. Oh, well, that, that takes care of everybody. Uh, Dave, what about Dave? Dave has a dinner date, and so have I. Or at least I will have. What do you mean? Well, the movies start pretty early, so I thought I'd go over and pick up Clara now, and then we stop off downtown and get something to eat. Well, yeah, well, then, then what about me? Uh, I, I have to get something to eat. The turkey's in the oven. Help yourself. <laughs> I didn't expect you. Why? Am I early? Well, I don't think my folks are ready to leave yet. Leave? We didn't expect you to pick us up. Hello there. Uh, Dad, I'd like you to meet Ricky Nelson. Oh, hello, Mr. Edwards. Hello, Ricky. Glad to know you. Come on in the living room and sit down. My wife isn't quite ready yet. Here, let me take your coat. Thank you. It was awfully nice of your parents to invite us all over to dinner tonight. 
Uh, Mr. Edwards, didn't you meet my father in the drugstore? Last night? Well, no, this afternoon. Well, I haven't been to the drugstore since last night. You seem so confused, Rick. Is anything wrong? Oh, uh, not exactly. Just hereditary, I guess. <laughs> well, uh, I'll go up and tell Mother you're here. Sit down, Rick. Thank you. I hope your mother didn't go to a lot of trouble for us. Oh, uh, no, sir. I'm positive she didn't. It's uh, very nice of your folks to have us. You know, being new in town, we don't know too many people, and we're still not quite settled. Oh. Well, I noticed you have a telephone out in the hall. Yes. Well, did you have any trouble getting it connected? Oh, no. They connected it last week. Oh. Well, is it working all right? Yes, I think so. The, the dial and everything? <laughs> yes. Would you like to use it? Yeah, if it's okay with you. Help yourself. Oh, thanks a lot. <laughs> Will somebody get that? Yeah, so I'll get it. Hello, this is emergency hospital. What did you say that for? Well, in case it's for Doc, I don't want him to get into trouble. Hello? Oh, hi. Is Pop there? Uh, yeah, uh, just a second. It's for you, Pop. <laughs> Rick. Hello, Rick. Oh, hi, Pop. Hey, what time were you and Mom expecting us for dinner? We're not expecting you for dinner. Yes, you are. No, no, I told you. I met Connie's father at the drugstore, and they're not coming over here for dinner. Yes, they are. No, 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 they're not. Rick? Uh, Rick? Hello? I'm here, Pop. I just couldn't talk. Well, what's going on? I don't know, but Connie's mother and father are getting ready to come over to our house for dinner. Well, they can't do that. Mr. Johnson told me you were supposed to have dinner over there. Who's Mr. Johnson? Well, this... <laughs> Just a second. Uh, uh, are you going out, Dave? Yeah, I'm going over to Helen Johnson's for dinner. Uh, Helen Johnson? I is her father's name Mr. Johnson? Mm -hmm. oh, yes, of course it is. <laughs> We're all set, Rick. Oh, swell. Well, I gotta go, Pop. I'll see you later. You know, Rick, wait a second. Look, stall him as long as you can. Okay, I'll try. Uh, Rick? Hello? Hello? Good night, Pop. Uh, goodbye. Good luck, Dave. Dave. Come on, off. let's play. Hey, hello? Uh, uh, fellows, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, we'll have to get all this stuff out of here right away. Uh, I'm expecting guests for dinner. Yeah. <laughs> you think he's kidding? <laughs> well, probably. You know Oz. <laughs> okay, high card deals. 